Dave and Julie here. Uh, we're both members of the Practice Health Champions in Bradbury. And I'd just like to tell you a little bit about why it helped us so much in each of our disabilities. Mine's very bad COPD. And the wife said breast cancer, which she's still suffering from now. The Health Champions at Alvan, they did walks. And that got me into thinking, well, it, if we can go with them, then do it. So it didn't matter how slow you were, everybody kept up with you. And surprisingly enough, that's how it worked. And we still do now only go as fast as the slowest walker. Going on the walks helped us both mentally and physically. Physically by building our bodies up and mentally by giving us the ability to do what we thought we couldn't do. Yeah. yeah. And also, it was the fact that there was people there. You weren't on your own. You had a natter, you had a laugh, and, you know, we just walked. And when they walked, they also walked with medical equipment. Yeah. So you were safe. Yeah. We both got great help and support from the Alvinoid Champions, so we decided we wanted to give something back. As we both keen gardeners, we thought a community allotment would be something we could help with. I rang up the council and they gave us the allotment for free and then we got in touch with George Cox, a local firm, and they gave their apprentices. They cleared the allotment, hadn't been used for 40 years and they got it ready for planting. Once it's finished we need to get a big, we call it a shed, uh, hopefully, because what we want is that to become a community hub. Um, a bit like the Civic Centre. You know, we can all, everybody can meet there. We want arts and crafts, mosaics, even woodwork. We're going to get the men in sheds or, uh, to come in once a week. They're willing to give their time to show people how to do things. And basically, we just want to get the community together to learn how to grow and how to cook. There's a right buzz about Woodley now, which wasn't there before. This has been created by the health champions, nothing else. I can't see why this buzz can't go to all surgeries everywhere and get the people out of the doctors yeah. and back into society. Yeah. So many lonely people out there that really do not know, what, know to do. what to do they're on their own we, we know because we have pulled them together with the singing and we pull the old people together they don't go to the doctors anymore which is absolutely brilliant they used to be the worst attenders attenders for the doctors and now they go into the doctors and actually say i bobbed in because i haven't seen you for a long while and i just want to know and let you know yeah. and that's actually happened what the practice champions do is known as social prescribing we have a well-being prescription pad in reception and in the doctors and nurses consulting rooms and it covers a whole range of things that people can do to improve their well-being without the need of medica medication no, we've had instances where people have actually gone to the doctors uh, with depression, anxiety um, and the doctor, the GP has spoken uh, to them about our prescription and showed it and they've actually walked away with the prescription and uh, for the um, health champions and not received any pills or medication at all. A lot of the time all they want is somebody to listen to, to them, basically.